And good afternoon. Good afternoon. Welcome. And good afternoon. We can't see you. Oh, no, now we can see you. Okay. Hello. So I, I hope you can see me and hear me as well. Uh, yeah, we can hear you and we can see you. Welcome to our meeting. Uh, we have 15 minutes uh, for the uh, presentation, Q&A and uh, summary of the, of the meeting. Uh, so I think uh, I would like to introduce um, the team from our side, the uh, Queen Hadik Academy. My name is Nożna Bieleska. I'm chairing this uh, uh, hearings. Uh, I'm an uh, VC investor and manager with um, quite significant experience, experience also in investment banking. My colleagues, uh, Magda, Magdalena Kluczek, she's a very experienced uh, broker uh, uh, working in, uh, with insurance companies for many years. And uh, Zbigniew Derdziuk, um, he has quite, quite a eclectic experience uh, because he has he used to be two times a, a, a minister. Also, he was chairing uh, our pension uh, fund, ZUS, and now he's managing a real estate company. Uh, so actually not real estate, but let's say that real estate company. Uh, so this is us, and now the floor is yours. So please tell us about yourself and uh, why you are applying for the scholarship. Sure, I will uh, share my screen so that you can see my presentation, okay? Please. Okay, uh, can you see everything? Yes, we can. We'll, we'll tell you, we'll let you know if we can't see you all uh, here, okay? So don't, let's mm. don't stop. Okay. Uh, so, uh, good afternoon, uh, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Tobias Dombrowski. I'm from Poniatowski High School, and I'm here to tell you a little bit about myself. Uh, so, uh, let's start from the beginning, from the very beginning. Of course, as almost uh, every child, I believe, I was a very curious one, and uh, I learned how to read when I was five, and since then, I really enjoyed doing it. Um, but my greatest passion really is space, especially um, uh, especially manned space exploration. So nowadays we live in times really similar to the fast space race in the 20th century, but the race is between uh, the private companies and corporations. Uh, and I'm really fascinated about the latest advancements in this area. Uh, of course, uh, SpaceX is really amazing with their Starship, but other smaller companies um, are also, um, yeah, they're, uh, they're all amazing too. Uh, and some of them have facilities uh, in Silicon Valley. Um, and such a huge company such as Lockheed, Lockheed Martin actually has a facility there. But there is also a smaller st uh, startup called Space Pharma, which has a, uh, I believe, headquarters in Silicon Valley. So I really hope to um, to see these facilities, to see these places um, uh, during uh, my visit to United States. Of course, we can forget about um, the government programs, such as the Artemis program, uh, which is really pushing the boundaries of uh, what um, humans, hum, humanity as a species uh, can do uh, with manned space exploration. And even though I'm only in high school, I developed myself in this area. Uh, last year with my two friends, uh, Jeremy Szenotabzowski and Luka Rovskog, we participated in an international competition organized by the European Space Agency and the Airbus Foundation. Uh, the competition is called uh, is called Moon Camp Challenge, and uh, it consists of of designing a 3D moon base uh, in a program called Tinkercad. And we designed one. We called it Hermaszewski Moon Camp from the name of, of course, of uh, our famous Polish cosmonaut. And uh, we won the competition, and it was a great success uh, because it was on the international level, and we were the best from from all the world, actually. And uh, we were also invited, um, thanks to this, to the Polish radio, when, where we were interviewed. We were also interviewed in TVN. And I also gave a presentation about our Hermaszewski Moon Camp during Bielany Nordbicze 
event. Uh, recently, uh, I've also created with the help of Poniatowski Foundation, ICAR, which stands for uh, Interdizalne Koło Astronautyczne Rakietowe. It's a special interest group where we plan to uh, eventually build our very own amateur rocket. Um, uh, if you can, uh, if you want to know a little bit more about this project, uh, you can visit ikar.edu.pl and uh, read about it there. Uh, so we really, um, really collab collaborate during uh, our, let's say, classes. Um, and I believe the great corporations such as Google and Microsoft, the corporations from um, the Silicon Valley, um, really value teamwork too. So by traveling to the United States, I really hope to maybe learn some new collaboration techniques and learn uh, more about teamwork because uh, teamwork is very important in nowadays world. Um, I also have times for my other hobbies and other achievements. For example, recently I've participated in uh, National Ecology Olympiad and now I'm in the central national stage and in a few weeks we will see how will it go because uh, I will write it then. I also play guitar and play Dungeons and Dragons with my friends. Um, and uh, these hobbies help me uh, to be more creative. Recently, I'm also into 3D printing, which is uh, maybe it's not a novelty, but it's, re it's really used nowadays. And uh, maybe I'll, I'll uh, yeah, I hope I will learn a little bit more about this technology during uh, the scholarship. So oh, yes, thank you very thank much. You. Uh, okay. You, yes. you managed to <laughs> present yourself within the time uh, schedule. Um, thank you very much for the presentation. Thank and, you very uh, much. And I will give the floor now with the questions to uh, Zbigniew, maybe. Um, so, please. Okay. Tobias, thanks for your presentation. I, I uh, uh, read your uh, essay about Hermaszewski, and my question is, what do you want to 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 plan to study uh, and how you can develop uh, your passion, which is the space uh, science, uh, during your career path, and how this trip can help it to you? Uh, yes. So um, first of all, I already develop um, this um, this let's say career path. Uh, associated with space industry by, for example, creating this special interest group. Uh, and I plan to um, I plan to take part in more uh, projects like this. And uh, by taking part in Queen Hedwig scholarship, I believe I would uh, during the, the um, during the trip to uh, United States, uh, I would learn more about new technologies. Uh, also, actually, there is uh, a um, an American astronaut with uh, Polish ancestors, Scott Perazinski. Uh, he had graduated Stanford uh, Medical University, and I I would really like to see this place in person and maybe follow his footsteps. Thanks. Thank you, Magda. Thank you. Yes, thank you, Marzena. Uh, first of all, I really admire your your passion because for me, space is something is something incredible, and uh, you know, uh, really admire that you are a, a kind of a specialist in in this area. Uh, so my question is, um, how uh, your environment, and your colleagues, maybe your school will benefit from? Uh, the scholarship that you uh, uh, maybe uh, get uh, from from uh, Queen Hedwig Academy. Mm -hmm. So uh, I believe the people who would greatly benefit from this are the people from ICAR because um, actually the this, this special interest group um, I created it uh, this year. So uh, we really don't have much experience with uh, teamwork and on working with projects like that. Uh, and yeah, these great, um, these enormous uh, companies uh, in Silicon Valley have this experience, and I could learn from their experience, and then, uh, and then show my like uh, learn my colleagues to uh, learn. Yeah, I show them these strategies, these techniques uh, which I used, uh, which I used by the success, the most successful companies in the world. So we can hopefully. And be as successful as them. 
Um, the question from my side, if you had a chance to meet Elon Musk, what would be your, the only question you, you could ask him or you would want to, uh, to ask him? Mm -hmm. um, so I, I believe it would be a technical question because um, the recently develop, developed by SpaceX, the rocket engine used in Starship, um, is it's a uh, full flow staged combustion cycle methane engine. And um, with an interview with Elon Musk made by Tim Dodd, um, he showed the engine and um, the ignition system was actually like it was almost non-existent. And I'm really curious how the ignition system works because uh, the SpaceX team, I believe, was working to simplify the process of ignition. And I would really uh, like to know uh, what Elon Musk, uh, because Elon Musk said it's, it's the secret sauce and he can't share it. But if I were to ask one question, then it would be about the ignition system on their uh, on their newest engines. Thank you. I wanted to thank you for the uh, very comprehensive uh, and uh, well prepared uh, presentation about you and uh, uh, we would like to congratulate that you are one of the 100 or almost 100 candidates. So you achieved, you achieved uh, already a lot and um, uh, you answered the questions uh, we, we, asked, we wanted to ask you to understand why you are applying for the scholarship. I would ask uh, Zbyszek maybe to uh, summarize uh, our meeting with uh, Tobias. Uh, I wish you that you will work so hard like your hero in your essay because you uh, write uh, about his uh, career path, which was very difficult. And you are lucky to have uh, this passion in much better condition. And I wish you that you will be able to develop and find the, how to combine the passion and the, really your work uh, in the future. Well and done. The any comments, Magda? Would like you would like maybe to add something? Yes, of course. Uh, I'm really impressed by you, Tobias, uh, and your presentation. And uh, what I would like to say to you: never give up, uh, because probably you will have many obstacles on your path, as uh, many of uh, uh, great people. Uh, so I cross my fingers for your career, and I think that. Uh, we can meet maybe in space, maybe on the moon. So I wish you very, very uh, lucky path of your career and all the best. Mm -hmm. And in your case, um, the wording, the sky is the limit is probably the, the best, <laughs> the best one to sum uh, your uh, goals and uh, achievements so far. So good luck. Uh, within uh, uh, two or three weeks, I can't uh, uh, tell you now exactly when, there should be information about the result of these hearings and uh, and uh, we wish you uh, the best luck uh, and uh, maybe you will have a chance to uh, to meet uh, Elon Musk or other people you believe it's worth meeting on your uh, path to, to the future. Thank you very I much. I really hope so. Thank you very much. It was a pleasure. Thank you very much again. Thank you. And Bye -bye. goodbye. Bye.